President Biden is calling for congressional action on gun control after another mass shooting, this time in Sacramento. Six people were killed and 12 others injured early Sunday morning when police say at least two people opened fire outside crowded bars in the city's downtown district. The suspects are still at large. Molly Real from our CBS affiliate KOVR has more from Sacramento. It's become an all too common sight. Hordes of people running from gunfire. We five people down. I got another one for you, uh, another gunshot. This latest crime scene just two blocks away from the steps of California's state capitol building in Sacramento. Investigators say multiple shooters opened fire as crowds were streaming out of closing bars early Sunday morning. While a motive for the shooting has not been identified, police are also reviewing this video of a large fight that broke out right before the gunfire. It's unclear if the two are connected. In the aftermath, family members and friends rushed to the scene to try and find missing loved ones. That's where the father of Devossier Turner learned his son was among the casualties. As I understand, uh, he walked out the club and he walked into some and got shot. Nationwide, there have been 120 mass shootings since the start of the year. That averages out to more than one a day. And it's the second mass shooting in Sacramento in just five weeks. It is a sickness in our culture, and we must do everything we can to heal that sickness. Investigators haven't yet said what types of weapons were used in this shooting. This is the worst mass shooting in Sacramento history. Gail. Wow. Awful story. Thank you very much, Molly Real from our affiliate. That's KOVR.